let's see. We're still going through all these cars. There's something really, really cool in here. Uh, look at this. This ain't it, but this is still cool. All right, the 1999 first edition 1936 cord. Uh, like a deep ox blood metallic paint job on that thing. Beautiful car. Beautiful car. You can't tell by the lighting in here, but there it is. There it is. And then there's another one. 36 cord. Not the um, not the first edition, but the 3D screensaver one. And a green metallic. Nice looking car. It's got the yellow, yellowed plastic on there, but there's the two of them. Kind of neat. They were sort of close together in the box. Right? So those are, that's kind of cool. Uh, okay. This one down here, though. I'm like digging down the bottom of the box here and different stuff. So I'm getting out of, getting a little bit out of, uh, wow, what, I don't know what this is. Look at this. The blue book. You actually have, you have a book that comes with this one. And you get uh, exclusive vehicles. Which, I don't know how exclusive these are, because that little guy right there, I've seen him before. But. Limited edition Hot Wheels Blue Book. It's bound reference source for all the cool new Hot Wheels cars available in 2002. So that's kind of neat. Never seen that before. That was from Marks. And, yeah, that's kind of cool. Look at them cars there. And you get that little blue book. Thing. Man, you know, they should do that with every year. That's what I need. That's why I'm kind of doing these videos, so I can kind of go back and see what I have in a in particular tote or not. Well, that's neat, huh? Okay. Someone probably want to pay me like 50 bucks for that set. Maybe a hundred. Maybe a dollar. I don't know. Okay. All right. Well, here's one here. Another one of them boats. Flamethrower series. High-speed airfoil. Uh, coolest to collect, it says, but it's a boat, you know. Kind of like that other one. I think we've seen a few of them. We've seen a few of them through the through the thing, the process here. Is a, might as well put it with the helicopter, you know. Stuff you can't race on the track by Hot Wheels. But that's still cool. That thing pulls out, the tail pulls out, and proper chopper, and it's got a a front end loader on the picture. So that must be I don't know, like working working series or something like, like that. I don't know, it's kind of neat. Like you got that, so ah, yeah. um okay. What am I doing here? Making these too high. All right. We don't want to do that. So. Man, I am getting tired. Woo! Okay. Let's see if we got. Oh, here's another one. Here's one we found. We had this one earlier. This is a beautiful car. 65 Vet Black with uh, little metallic sparkles in it. I know there's an extra one of them in there. Look at that. Yeah, nice car. Okay, that's a nice car. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice indeed, Hot Wheels, on that one. Design that's a beautiful. There's another one of them. Uh, here's another one of these guys. What's it? Oh no, that's a Dash for Cash series Dodge Viper. I know we had one of them earlier on another video, but I don't know if we had that paint scheme. Oh, whoa. There you go. All right. Man. Okay. I'm getting a little. There we go. All right, let's see. Oh, look at this thing. Dang. This thing looks crazy. 1996 first edition street cleaver. Wow. Look at that. Imagine this thing coming down the road at you. Holy smokes. Get out of the way. Wow. Yep. That probably don't even fit in your little 48 case you know, holder. Okay, let me see. 
guys here. I'll slide them down. Mm. Here's a Pinstripe Power Series. 65 in power. Spiderweb hanging off of it. Okay, okay. Sorry about the lighting in here. There you go. Okay. There's that. So you got that going for you. Here's another one of them uh, Rigger Motors. Yellow card. Or yellow yellow plastic. Um, red. Red one. Hard to see. There he is. Okay, there's the card. Hot Wheels Collector Poster. Race hard, finish first. There you go. All right. Okay, noted. Race hard, finish first. Let me get these guys down in there. So, ugh, sideways. Okay. How much time we got? Okay, we're halfway. A little, little over halfway. Here's one. 1998 first editions. 63 T-Bird. This almost looks like a fantasy car, but man. That's the real deal, man. Just disproportionate, you know, how they, you know, some of them were just kind of, but it's sharp looking. Hard to see on there, but it's got that metallic paint. Sparklies in it, real nice, real nice. Heavy, too. That's steel on steel, man. Steel on steel. I think I got this one, but not in this color. Okay, so... Okay, let's see what else we got. Here's another one like that. Low and Cool Series 59 Caddy. This thing is absolutely huge, but it's like, talk about disproportion, man. This car is like 100 foot long, and it's like, look at this. There it is. Nice pink Barbie doll color. Kind of. It's not a Barbie car, though. But look how skinny this thing is. It's like, what the hell? <laughs> Okay, so anyway. Yeah, that's just weird looking. Damn, you could almost get two of these on the track. That's how skinny it that is. You see, like, compared to a regular car. Look at this thing. I don't know if you can you see that. Let's see. A... Look at that. See how skinny that thing is? That's like the R word. That's messed up. Yeah, low and cool series caddy. I can see him chopping them. Oh, you know what else? Look at this. Look at it. Look at inside there. Look at the little. Let's see this here. See the little steering wheel thing? It's like a hole with a little teeny tiny steering wheel in there. I don't like this casting. I don't think anybody else did either because it's like weird. That might be one that you could steal the wheels off of it or something, you know? But, yeah, this is, like, dumb. Stupid. Anyway, um, 1999 first edition Chrysler Pronto. It's like, sort of looks like a, front end looks like a PT Cruiser. And it looks like it's a little tuned also, but. I can get that glare out of there if I can. A little bit, sort of. There's the back. It looks like a little hat, like. Almost like a PT Cruiser. Remember those? I used to have a PT Cruiser. I loved it. It got a little rust spot on the back of the, of the hatchback. And I was like, you know what? These are probably junk. I got to get rid of this thing. And now I don't see as many of them on the road as there used to be. But I liked it. It kind of reminded me like a Volkswagen when you're sitting in it. Like a Volkswagen Beetle. All right, how much time we got? Okay, about three more minutes. Here, I know I got these. I got these guys, and um, I don't know if I have the first edition, though. I think I got these guys loose. 1998 first edition, double vision. Look, for the year 2020, the double vision, first edition, 1998. See, they knew something. Oh, no, 2020, they're talking about, like, eyes. Still, it's cool. It's 2020, and this is 2020, and it's double vision, and it's the first edition, and it's like... Okay, enough of that. Put these guys together. Double Vision 2020. Okay. LA. Okay. Nice. All right. 
I got a. Um, I feel a sneeze coming on, so don't get scared. Okay. Ew, corona. Oh, man. Wow. i never seen it in this color. Jaguar D-Type. I'm not sure. Don't quote me on this, but there's a Walmart price tag for 92 cents on here. I think I have the blue one, and the blue one might be first edition, but this red one kind of is kind of fancy. How about the glare? Dang glare. See the tempos on top? It's like, it looks better in real life. Never seen that one yet like that. I got a blue one. A couple blue ones. And then you got the uh, Penage GTR1. Which, to be perfectly honest, I don't know if that's a real car or if that's a fantasy car. That might be some kind of concept car or something. Got some pretty neat tempos on there though. Something on the hood. Kind of cool. All right. Kind of, kind of exciting. These guys down there don't get to see. All right. Don't worry about all the junk in the background back there. See? Can you see? Um. What, what is back there? License plates and stuff. Okay. Running out of time. One more. Two more, because I already got this one. Ooh, 1999 first edition. Screaming Holler. Pretty purple car, but, you know, fantasy car. If you're into that fantasy sort of thing. There you go. These guys, I'm not selling these. You know, that's, I'm not, like, doing a sales thing here. I'm just, like, doing a little video showing you these cars that I got from, uh, from the auction and from my friend John and my friend Bob and some guy named Don and other places. There's one right there. What's this thing? Phaeton? We've seen one of them before. Phaeton? Something like that. I don't know. Anyway, that's that. Okay. Well. Uh, leg cramp. Man, I can't even see the bottom of this box yet, so. I guess we'll just keep on going, making some more videos, man. Okay, I hope you guys are enjoying this. If you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead and like, subscribe, ring that notification bell. Or don't. Don't do anything. And uh, if you're watching this on Facebook, whatever, man. You know, it's like, just give it a thumbs up. Whatever you're supposed to do. Uh, you know, or if, if this is boring you, don't watch it. Okay? Alright, look at this, man. I'm going crazy here with this hair. Alright, uh, we're out of here.